die ist auch im Mord, in dem Gericht, das ging später auch Jürgen nach dem Brüten. So, das hat wirklich viel zu sagen, was ich auch mit dem Vorfeld schon auf Schürfen liegt, die die Hardcore auf Folgen zu bringen.
We have done this since September 2007, and the experience so far are actually very encouraging. So we will do an evaluation of this uh, uh, way of teaching, and then of course share our lessons learned with the FID community. Looking at the program for the workshop, you have three very exciting days ahead of you. E-learning and applications within our professional areas is not just about implementation of new technologies. It is basically, I think, about re-engineering university concepts to include a more flexible learning environment and a changing role for the university towards a more open communication with society. There's no doubt that global drivers such as improvement in storage and transmission capacity and also in computation and visualization as well as mobile technologies will change dramatically the university learning environment. Knowledge management is the key word in this process. This includes online, on, online access as we have now and online access to the news, technology, the news knowledge that should also be structured in a way so that it is easily accessible for professional practice. So it's not only about inside the university, it's just as well the communication between university and professional practice and society as such. I wish you all the best for the successful workshop. I think that it's very timely in any sense. So on behalf of FID, I warmly welcome you all, and I do look forward to seeing many of you again in a few days in Stockholm. Thank you very much.